Hey everyone, welcome to Data Millennials. I'm Atul, and in today's video, we are going to discuss about the replace function in SQL. So let's go and see what exactly is this replace function. So this replace function allows you to replace a sequence of characters in a particular string with another set of characters. So in a nutshell, if you want to replace a particular part of a string with another substring, you can use this replace function, and it's mostly useful when when you are using with a special characters column for example so in our subscriber base table we have email id of our all subscribers right so what we can do is that we can replace this at the rate gmail.com with a particular substring okay and this is mostly useful when you want to particularly replace a special character uh, within a string or you want to replace something and insert a particular part of a string after the replacement then this replace function is very useful so let's go and in our example what we'll do is that we will replace this at the rate gmail.com uh, with at the rate gmail1.com or something else so what we can do is that we can write select email id and then we will use this replace function so this replace function have a certain syntax and the first part of the syntax is that you have to give the string or the cat or the column name from which you want to replace it so for us it is email id and then the second part of this syntax is the string to replace so for us the string to replace will be this at the rate gmail.com right so what i'll do is that i'll simply put at the rate gmail.com within this double quote and now the third argument that this function requires is the replacement string so with which string you want to replace this at the rate gmail.com so let's keep only gmail and then let's put dot underscore com so what we what we want to do is that we want to replace this particular at the rate gmail.com with this particular substring gmail underscore dot underscore dot com so now if i run this query you will see that your data within the output has this particular format so you have your name and then you have gmail underscore dot underscore com so this is how basically you can use the replace function to replace a sequence of character in a string if you want to learn more about sql you can click on the right side of this video or if you're interested in excel you can click on the left hand side of this video